Is C++ statically typed or dynamically typed? Let's find out. C++ is a statically typed language which means type is known at compile time. And this means the type information of a variable is known to the compiler at compilation time. This means if we define a variable of a specific type, we cannot assign a different kind of value to it. For example, here I have defined this variable age of type integer. Therefore, this variable can hold an integer value. But if we try to assign a different kind of value, let's say a string to this variable, then we will get error from the compiler. We are getting error from the compiler because compiler already knows the type of this variable. This variable is of type integer. Therefore, it can only hold an integer value. If we try to assign a different kind of value to it, then compiler will throw an error. Now let's discuss some advantages and disadvantages of C++ being statically typed. The obvious advantage is early error detection. Type-related errors are caught at the time of compilation itself. This leads to early error detection. We do not have to wait till the program runs. Now here comes the second advantage, faster performance. Type checking is done at the compilation itself. Therefore, at runtime, there is less overhead of checking the type. Hence, this leads to faster performance. Now, apart from these advantages, we have a disadvantage of C++ being statically typed and it is less flexibility for dynamic behavior. C++ is less flexible because once the variable is defined of a specific type, it can only hold that type of value. We cannot assign a different kind of value to it. So there is no dynamic behavior. So these are some of the advantages and disadvantages. And now we know that C++ is a statically typed language. Want to learn C++? Follow our C++ programming course.